Mm -hmm. I'm not sure how it works if Mexico and the U.S. could end up battling for the whole thing. That would Whether be they're in, I guess it's wherever, what section they're in. Everyone's getting really excited, though, yeah. I think, about soccer. A lot of people are going out to the park and they're and discovering it. the game. A lot of people yes. don't watch it. Now I have a reason to watch it. That's true, including yeah. my daughter. She takes the ball throughout uh. the grocery <laughs> store and is kicking through the aisles. A better place to kick the ball out over toward Balboa Park today. We did have a few of those clouds early in the morning, but those clouds are actually forecasted to clear a little bit earlier in the day, and thus temperatures are going to warm up at least until we get to the middle half of the work week. Right now, dealing with a few clouds in the sky, temperatures looking at about 65 degrees, noticing our wind speeds fairly calm. Forecasted to remain just about 10 miles per hour for the coast and inland areas. Mountains and deserts could see their winds pick up to a little bit of a breeze for you once we get around 5 o'clock. The reason is this upper level high pressure system, that's beginning to move on into place. And with that, we end up seeing sinking air. Hard for clouds really to form. So the marine layer that tries to build in the morning, not going to last very long. In fact, high Pressure is going to kick those clouds on out, and as a result, temperatures will warm until this cold front. Not going to slice through our area, but it will bring the chillier air mass down through Southern California, and as a result, you'll see the more clouds as we head on in through about Thursday and Friday. Rain cloud forecast at 7 a.m. The marine layer pushing all the way out over toward Poway, even into La Mesa, and out through Lemon Grove, covering I-15 most likely until we get to around the 10 a.m. hour. Not clearing the coastline until we get to probably around 11 o'clock or so this day. Pretty similar to what we experienced for today. It's going to be Wednesday. You're going to see the clouds. Not really out there by 7 a.m., just right along the beaches. So, Wednesday will be our warmest day. And when that trough, that cold front that's going to move close to us, that's going to bring an increase in cloud coverage on Thursday. So, construction workers probably happy about that. That'll dr drop temperatures for you Thursday and Friday. Seven day forecast 72 degrees on Tuesday, 73 Wednesday. Inland, 80 degrees. You'll see 81 on Wednesday. A little bit more clouds on Thursday. The mountains, 84 degrees for tomorrow. PM winds picking up. The deserts looking at the triple digits again at 106. Guys, back to you. Sabrina, thank you so much.